In this video, we are going to learn how to deal with list view control. First of all, go to main.xml in composite list view, just drag and drop, adjust the size as you want. Delete it. Go to the Java file and we have first of all we have to use the list view and create list declaring the list view variable as lv. You don't know how to auto format press control shift and f. We are using the string array. Let's say list. And after that we have to register the list view control if you don't save it just save it control shift and s otherwise it will not show you the control in r.java file and after that we have to typecast it otherwise it will show you the error because it don't know how to uh, which control it will id bind with list view control so we have to pass the list view to tell list view, lv variable list which is list view variable to choose the which uh, list view control it will assign the value the controls comes from r.java file in id dot list view one control name we are using the array adapter to perform this operation We are creating the array adapter object, let's say ARD. We are using a this instead of get application context, otherwise we will not get the proper output. Here we are using the android package dot r dot layout dot simple list item one in the objects we are passing the list view list array after that we have to after assigning the array adapter we have to bind the value bind the adapter so for binding we are using the list view dot set adapter and the adapter array adapter object name we can uh, use uh, list view control with uh, say on item click and on item long click listeners. We are going to see both ways. Here you can see on item click and item long click. We are using the first one. If you seems the error, don't panic. Just import it, save it, and add an implementation methods. Here you can give the any variable name. I change it to position, and we are displaying simple toast. get application context this will dot get item at position don't forget to pass the duration length dot short dot show save it if you we are uh, for long long press event lv dot set item set on 
item don't forget to check the set on item long click listener instead of set on long click listener otherwise it will not work be specific in this case same previous error don't panic repeat the previous steps This way, just save it. Right click on your project, go to Run as Android application, and it will monitor in console. If you don't get it, change it to DDMS to Android. It will show you the installing and the processing, which is done on the emulator. See, it's starting the activities. here it is android it is windows it is ios just long press long press event is occurred if you use number of items it will automatically add the scroll view if you don't know how to increase the emulator's timeout just uh, see my tutorial number two to how to increase the timeout of emulator Thank you for watching video, subscribe us for latest videos and updates.